So today we're gonna do a pH test. I got some brand name waters and I got some Hawaiian waters. Um, the first one is Alkaline 88. It's supposed to be advertised as 8.8 uh, .8 on the pH. Second is Avian. The third one is Fiji. This is a Hawaiian brand, Hawaiian Springs. Next one is Aloha Y. Hawaiian Isles. This big bottle is Menihuni Water. This one is sold in all 7 Eleven in Hawaii. Island Pure. Dasani Water. Aquafina. And Chrysler Glacier. The last one I'm going to test is my tap water in Kaimoki. I guess every part of the island has different pH, but I'm located centrally on Oahu, so that's uh, going to be a testing for Kaimoki area. So I'll be testing with this liquid solution. I'll be using only two strips of uh, pH. Uh, since this is very expensive, I'll probably do the one that is m the most acidic and the most alkaline. So to do all this test, these are unopened. I'm going to be snapping each one open and then doing the test. And I'll be dumping the finished one in this right here. The first one, alkaline 88. Filling this up. So it came out completely blue. So that would be probably on the 8.5 to probably 9. Show it right over there. So I guess what they're advertising is correct. Next one is avian water. Snapping this open. Okay. So I'll be rinsing this first. A couple drops. So this is the avian right over here, the color. This is actually not that bad. It's probably between seven or eight, probably closer to eight. So it's pretty, pretty up on the pH scale. Next one is Fiji water. Okay. I'll be rinsing it one more time again with this water. So this, I don't know if you can see this, it's sort of a little bit below, somewhere between 6.5 and 7, closer to 7. Let me close this up. And so the next Hawaiian brand we have is Hawaiian Springs. So I'll be testing this out. First we rinse it, sample there. Give it a shake. That's the color for Hawaiian Springs, which is not actually bad at all. That it comes right in the middle of seven. Next one we got is Aloha Y. Let's get that one. Ooh, okay.
okay so we got a complete opposite we have about complete yellow which probably comes between 4.5 to 5 closer to 5 perhaps interesting next one we have is Hawaiian Isles again I'll be rinsing it out with each single one shake okay so this one comes out a little bit on the orange yellowish side it kind of looks between five to six between let me cap up that one and then this big bottle here couldn't find a small bottle so i decided uh we'll go with the big bottle Okay, this is yellowish, but it's almost going to green. So I would probably place this between somewhere between 6 and 6.5. Next is Island Pure. Again, we'll give this a quick rinse. Okay, Island Pure kind of came up greenish. It's right in the middle of seven and eight. Seven and eight. Island Pure. Next we have the Sunny Water. Okay, I guess the Sunny Water came out of uh, orange complete orange that would probably be around five next is aquafina get a few drops there Ooh, okay. So Aquafina came out almost the same, but it looks a little bit more towards the orange. Maybe same thing, it's probably around five. Cap that up. And then the last for the bottle water is Crystal Glacier. Give that a quick rinse. I don't know if you can see this, this is slightly going green, so between 6.5 to 7. Okay, and the, the last test we're going to do is tap water. So we're going to rinse this out with the tap water. Okay, so the tap water in Kaimoki is pretty
pretty high I don't know if you can see that that would probably be between 8 to 8.5 so since we did all of our testing let me see let's put this back over there I guess uh, let's put this in order let me shuffle it up right here I guess this one was orange orange I think this one was orange this one was neutral that one was a little bit better I think that was that Mm, this one was I think pretty similar and actually the tap water came probably the closest to alkaline 88 I think this one wasn't too bad so let's put this between here that looks about correct so since the pH paper is expensive, we're going to take one from the least pH. And then we'll go through the highest one. So Aquafina came out actually around 4 to 5, closer to 5 I would say. So let's give that a dunk. Two seconds. Okay, so let's read this. I don't know if you can see this, but it is a, a solid five. Okay. Now the highest bottled water is alkaline 88, which they're advertising at 8.8. .8. So let's try the pH on this one. One and two. Cap this up. Okay, so it doesn't completely look like a solid eight, but it looks like uh, between seven and eight if you look on that pH scale. So I don't know about 8.8 .8, but it is a solid 7.5 what it seems to be but anyways I'm not no water expert I'm just uh, ranking this between the lowest to the highest and that is the end of my video thank you